Hi guys, it's Danny. I'm back with another process video. This is going to be a plan with me video. I have not done one of these in forever, you guys. Um, I hope you guys still like to watch them. Um, I'm a little rusty, but I totally loved doing this. It was so fun. I just got a new planner recently. I shared that uh, video in a haul. This is a six by six I'm going to use. It is called Stay Magical. And it was... Um, I got it at Michael's. I think it's, I believe it's by Recollections. And I also ended up getting the 12 by 12 uh, paper pad. Oh, I love it so much. I'm pulling out some stamps now. Oh, I did show you really quickly. I got that new, well, it's not new, but it's new to me, that punch. I think it's, let me see. Oh yeah, the Happy Planner Punch. And I'm so stoked that they came out with this because you guys know I love to incorporate scrapbooking products into my planners like I love mixing both of them and let me tell you I do love a lot of the beautiful planning like stickers and like all the different Etsy shops a lot of them actually are just have their own websites now I love them but I can't afford to buy one for every single week like so this just makes my scrapbook stash like if I mix the two of them I just really love how it turned out like how it turns out when I mix them together. Um, I just showed you, I pulled out some stamps. I'm super stoked because, you know, I don't stamp that much. And I find that I actually do in my planner, remember to use my stamps. And these aren't even planner stamps. They're just cute stamps that I just happen, I don't know, I just like some of the elements. They have cute circles and different things. One of them was a birthday one because it is going to be my birthday on the 27th. Woohoo! All right, so yeah, so I wanted to pull out this birthday stamp, and now I am just looking at doing some more of the cut aparts. You guys know I like my planners pretty full, like, I don't like a lot of white space, so yeah, that's just kind of how I do my planner, and really excited and happy to get back into it. So, let's see. Oh, I'm just working on my sidebar now. And let's see. Oh, and I'm laying out some more of these. I just cut a few or or I don't know if you call cutting it, but I punched a few. <laughs> I always want to say cut, but it's punch. Um, that makes it so much quicker and easier. This paper pad is so stinking adorable. Like I haven't even touched. I, I haven't touched the um, 12 by 12 that I got. But just after I do this video, I already have ideas of doing a scrapbook layout. So I know that I'm going to be working on a scrapbook layout as soon as I'm done with this voiceover because I just love it so much. And it was awesome to use a 6x6 six six for this because you really get through like a good portion of it. And I don't know. I don't know if you guys are like me, but I love 6x6 six six and I feel like I don't use them as much as I use my 12x12s. 12 12. So I'm stoked to know another way for me to use my six by six paper pads because it really, you get a lot of bang for your buck and you really get them used up and it just feels awesome when you get things, you know, if you make a, if you make a good dent in things. And I just am laying out more different, you know, different squares, uh, just trying to fill up my page. And that's all I'm really doing right now. <laughs> It's like I still have a scrapbooker in me because I don't want to put too many colors close together. kind of want to make it feel balanced, you know, like just like I do in my scrapbook layouts. Yeah, but this was a lot of fun. <laughs> I forgot how much I missed it. Oh, and these washies. Oh my gosh, you guys, they pretty much go perfectly. I'm sure that I'm sure that Michael's or Recollections, I'm sure they did this on purpose and they're supposed to go with it. But yeah, these washi tapes are so awesome. They go so good with this line. Like I I got two different, there, I think there was a third one that I didn't get that actually has like the little, um, actually has like the little mermaid on it. Like a not the little mermaid, but a, you know, like a, a mermaid on it. And I didn't get that one, but the other two sets I got, I absolutely love, 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 love. Like this first one that I laid down looks kind of almost like, I don't know, it told, it just reminds me of like a mermaid's tail, but it's in like purple, purple and like, what do you call that? Holographic. 
I love it. And then um, jumping ahead a little bit, I'm going to eventually put this cloud washi down, a thin one. I have a thicker one, but I've never had a thin one. And the clouds are in, uh, in the holographic. And I love it. It's so cute. And then now I'm working at the bottom doing, and this is like a bunch of rainbows. Again, this was all, these are all from Recollections um, from Michael's. I love them. They are awesome. Here's the cloud one I was telling you guys about. It's so stinking cute. Super duper adorable. I'm really loving the holographic. And there's touches of holographic, as you can, you probably can tell, hopefully, in the papers as well. Not all of them, but some of them in the paper pad. So it's really adorable. It's kind of crazy because they're such a good price too. Um, you know, I think, I don't remember, it's probably like five something and then, then the hot buy is supposed to be almost seven, but they usually take like your extra 20 or 30%, whatever, if you have like an extra 20% off, they will usually take them. This was a piece of paper, it's the, uh, like the strips, and I didn't end up using it. Um, I took it out and I thought I would, and then I decided against it. I'm looking just to make sure. Yeah, I don't, I think I just ended up uh, deciding not to use it after all. Let's see. Just, ooh. oh, now I'm working on um, the scrapbook portion of it because you guys know I love to add pictures to my planner. So I bought those inserts. Um, I believe they're by the Happy Planner and they're just inserts so that you can put pictures and it comes with several different, you know, sizes and things. And I did share those on a haul video. So hopefully you guys already saw that. And they're not a new product, so I'm sure you guys are all, you know, aware of them and have seen them. But I love adding scrapbook, you know, pictures and things like that to my layout. Because I'm definitely a scrapbooker first and foremost at heart. And then and then I just like to dabble in everything else, you know. <laughs> I like doing the planners. I like doing the... I actually am starting to like cards a little bit again. I need to videotape, but I always feel insecure about my cards until they're all done. And then I'm like, oh, what is wrong with me? I love them. But um, yeah, I also have been really getting into like the traveler's notebooks as well. You guys, I'm so sorry about the glare. I have been on the lookout for um, the odd lights. A, a few of you or a lot of you have recommended going to Costco. Well, I've looked at three different Costcos and I can't seem to find an odd light. And then uh, one of you guys told me that sometimes they don't get them back in stock until it's closer to back to school. So forgive me for not the greatest lighting, um, but I am on the lookout. I know it's an issue and I want to fix it for sure. And believe me, the minute I anybody sees that they're back at Costco, please let me know. <laughs> yeah, because I definitely won't want to fix my lighting. All right, so these are some stickers from Paws Paper, and I that's P A W S, and I it, it was an Etsy shop. I haven't looked to make sure, but I'm pretty sure they're still in business. Um, it's like they're literally you know for planning, um, and I believe it's on Etsy. So if I find, I'm gonna go ahead and look after I get done with this voiceover and make sure, and then I'll go ahead and link them if they're still in business. And I hope that they are because I loved her planner. Um, she had really adorable kits and I like the paper and the stickers. And this is only a, like I only pulled out just a couple pieces of an actual really cute kit. So I do have a few left that I'm gonna be using up soon. So you guys will see those on, you guys will see those probably in the next week or two. I'll probably be using the actual like kit kit. They're so cute and adorable. But I thought these colors went really good. So I think it's cool to like mix some of their flags, you know, like the half boxes and little flags and things like that or things for an appointment. I like to mix those in with the new scrapbooking product. And then here is the close-ups. I just, I went ahead and jumped ahead a little bit because I just didn't want it, the video to get too crazy long. But now you can just kind of see with a little bit of writing. I didn't put all, I didn't put all of my writing in. But yeah, I really love how this turned out. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Would love for you to give me comments, suggestions, anything at all. And you have a wonderful day. And I'd love it if you give me a thumbs up and subscribe. I'll see you in the next video. Bye, guys.